Welcome to the family! Hey everybody, you have McGann, and today I'm going to get into these two different Pokemon All-Star volumes. I've got one and two. Both of them have 10 discs each, and as you can see, there has been quite a lot of wear and tear, like Pikachu's face has some color on it. The boxes are a little bit ripped here and there, but it's still good. It's still good. Now this one shows you the top 10 that they pick for this one. The Pikachu one keeps it more secretive, but if you line them up, you can see at the bottom, like these are the favorites from 1 to 20. At least they were as of the time of this release, which was 2009. So we're gonna start with Pikachu and show you these special editions. And I really like these boxes and how they're designed and you get stats on each one of the Pokemon that they've chosen. And then when you get it all opened up, you, whoa! Oh, I remember you Jigglypuff, you don't stick in very well. Oh, that's the problem, it lost a little piece of the hinge there. But our discs are Charizard, Squirtle, Pikachus up here, Jigglypuff, then Blastoise, Eevee, Bulbasaur, let's get your face up, baby. Lugia, Charmander, and Mudkip. I'll just go through this slowly putting it back if you want to marvel at the box art again. I'm not sure if I got them before, so I'll just linger for another second. And then Pikachu and J-Puff. And then for volume two, we have... Yeah, I've got to get you back out of here, buddy. Sorry. More really cute box art. I'm so glad that they kept up with that on both of the volumes. I'm just kind of sad that they didn't do a three. You would think they could do volumes of this for ages, hundreds and hundreds of volumes with all the Pokemon they have now. But they stopped. They stopped. Ah! Then our last one, Skitty and Chikorita over there. All right, Skitty. Ah, it's got the same problem as Jigglypuff. It broke on the same side. All right, we'll do this one. Oh no, what's happening? So we've got Trico, Meowth, Wobbuffet, Psyduck, Lapras, Skitty, Onyx is number 20, and Chikorita. I still call my daughter Chikorita sometimes. Then Torchic and Totodile. And we'll just fold that up. Woo! Of course I was gonna do that. I knew it was gonna happen. Linger a little bit, let you enjoy this gorgeous little stats box art. Looks like this one closes this way to where we get all oh, such cute little Meowth. Haha, <laughs> aren't I cheeky? And Trico, and then, nope, I totally screwed that one up. Skitty, no, stay in your home. Skitty, no. Ain't I worried? Lapras and Totodile. And then Meowth and Trico. And did we see the back? Torch again, Onyx, so cute. All right, hopefully these will all stay relatively in their disc holding places. But yes, if you are looking at these on Amazon, I do have a link in the description below that should take you straight to Amazon to find these. They're pretty good sets. You've got three episodes, I believe, on each disc. So it's not a huge amount of Pokemon on each disc, but if you think about it, you're getting 10 discs. So that's 30 episodes. And I think these were $20 when they were brand new 10 years ago. So the price is not unreasonable. Reasonable. Anyways, I hope this has been helpful. You've had McGann, and I'll see you next time, family members. If you had fun watching today's video, don't forget to subscribe so that you can see more, and let us know in the comments what other toy videos you might want to see in the future. Also, don't forget to check out our other channel, The Fan Girl, where we talk about all kinds of movies, TV shows, and even books and comics. But viewer discretion is advised. See you next time, family members!